You asked, what is the future of smart homes? It really seems as though smart homes have wide-reaching capabilities already, but what exactly will they be able to do in the future? Our prediction is that in the next decade, smart homes will come into their own and smart home automation will really become very exciting. It should be expected that the advancement in smart home functionality will be primarily thanks to the incorporation of artificial intelligence, or AI. So what will it be able to do exactly? Well, it's expected that eventually your home will be able to scan your schedule, automatically wake you up when you need to get up, turn on the kettle for your morning tea, and give you the latest news via TV, digital messages, or other devices. You will find out about the weather the same way, without even opening the curtains. These advancements are the reason why the global smart home device market is predicted to reach almost $140 billion in turnover by 2030. As more and more smart home devices reach the market, the more the capabilities of smart homes will increase. The future of smart homes is also expected to include widespread microphones around your home, so voice activation capabilities aren't limited to being within the proximity of a Google Home or Amazon Alexa. Other expected advancements also include whole walls that light up, preventing the need for central bulbs. In addition to this, we may see kitchens that can automatically scan the nutritional value of your food, as well as robotic mechanisms that can whip you up a meal. But you may be asking, what is a smart home? In a smart home, your phone is the remote control. Your devices from TV to air conditioning, hot water, lighting, washing machine, solar, batteries, and many more can be managed automatically via the connection of your smartphone and your home internet. The whole purpose is to save energy and increase the comfort level of your home, save you time and make your home safer. A smart home can start with simple plug and play devices, or it can start with a whole new security system or an integrated smart home lighting system, which will require the services of a specialist to get installed. The improvement in voice recognition technology has driven smart home development, whereby many devices can now be operated using voice commands instead of fiddling with buttons. Naturally, a smart home will need more sensors, cabling and equipment, and all these devices can still fail. Therefore, we recommend only purchasing and having installed smart home items where a solid after-sales service can be obtained for many years to come. Many smart home devices also have a remote fault-finding service and fault alarm as part of their makeup. For example, solar inverters and monitoring systems can now send alerts when the PV system produced less electricity than what should be expected. If a number of these alerts come through, then one should call a solar installer to check if one of the panels has any issues. Energy use reduction is and will be a key driver of smart home technology. Energy use and the smart use of solar can be achieved via sophisticated monitoring equipment, smart meters, and the tuning of devices such as heat pumps and pool pumps to align with maximum solar generation. This will then result in less renewable energy being exported and lower electricity bills, as heating and cooling can consume as much as 40% of a home's energy. Running air conditioners more efficiently is very important. In the future, smart thermostats will be controlling the heating and cooling equipment, allowing the units to be ramped up and down in line with data from room sensors and behavior patterns in the home. Zonal control will be one important consideration to reduce energy consumption because it makes no sense to heat or cool an area of the home that just isn't used. Electric vehicles of the future will be able to come home and have their battery connected to the home and either charge the battery or in the event of a blackout, actually supply the backup power for the home. There could be a display in your home or on your phone showing your current electricity running costs in real time and your accumulated costs. By getting visual indicators as to how much energy your home is using, you can influence the consumption to achieve lower electricity bills. More complex in-home displays, which will need to be connected to a smart meter, can also show the total power used in a home at a particular time. The electricity generated by the solar system, the power in watts supplied by the battery to the house in real time, and the costs or credits you are earning right now. Energy intensive devices can be turned off via timers or ramped down to minimize energy use. For example, a hot water system might reduce the heating of water during the night when there is less use expected and ramp up the temperature in the morning ready for the home's hot water consumption. Smart homes seem so advanced, leading a lot of people to ask, do I need a uni degree or some sort of training to operate a smart home? But the truth is, many of the future products in order to be successful will need to be very easy to operate. This means all generations in a home, the old and young, can benefit from the connected home. Many devices will just need to be plugged in and then quite automatically, often via AI, will create appropriate settings and protocols. 
Some smart lighting could need some extra programming and writing devices to get the most out of them. But we predict if a smart appliance or product is not simple, it just won't be successful. With a smart home, you can also get help from virtual assistants. Many of us already have had the experience of getting help from a virtual assistant. For example, we ask Alexa, what is the time? Alexa, play the best of crowded house music. In the future, we will be able to ask things like Alexa, please run a hot bath, or Alexa, the room is too hot, please make it cooler, 21 degrees would be ideal, or Alexa, the room is too bright, please close the blinds. By linking the virtual assistant, which is linked with a smart speaker with many other home devices, we can automate many processes which can save us time and money. Although we have to watch out that all these new smart home management devices don't chew up too much power and negate all the energy savings we have achieved in the first place. But maybe our virtual assistant can fix even that problem in the future years to come. So with all this connection, what about privacy in a smart home? There have been reports of security cameras in smart homes having been hacked and private data being stolen like in the Optus hack of 2022. Data protection and appropriate security protocols have to strengthen in line with the growth of the smart home in order to develop the trust with consumers required to grow this technology. These are just some of the advancements that can be expected and who knows how common they will actually be. But what you can certainly expect is that smart homes and smart home devices are only on the rise and the future of our homes will certainly consist of increased home automation and devices that haven't even been thought of yet. Finally, unfortunately right now, not all smart home devices are compatible. Different manufacturers offer different protocols and plugs and sometimes devices cannot talk to each other. It's a bit like with battery powered power tools. Many batteries will only fit their brand and not another manufacturer's device, but it is getting better and we would expect over time the industry will be standardized. So let's hope the homes of the future are indeed smart. Want more Energy Answered? Visit yourenergyanswers.com for quality energy products, tools and calculators, and find your quality local installers. Please support the channel by liking the video, hit that subscribe button and ring the bell and check out all our other videos. You're still here? I'll see you next time. Bye.